Hey everyone, Canadian Trucker here. Today we are in the town of West Memphis, Arkansas, just across the river from Memphis, Tennessee. Picking up a load of something or other tomorrow, going out to British Columbia. Got a 4,000 kilometer drive to get there. It's gonna take at least four days. Um, for supper today, we got a chicken breast filet and a garlic and herb seasoning. And that ain't right. This is menu 21. Which in 2013, 3070, 2013, this was lemon pepper tuna. So sometimes they run out and they substitute. This chicken breast in a garlic herb seasoning is something you'll find in a uh, first strike ration. So I guess they just, I'm guessing it's all the same components. Um, just the mayo will be swapped. So if it's got tortillas, fat-free mayo, hopefully not. Um, better to have a dairy shake. I read the stuff on MRE Info earlier and kind of forget, but we'll see. I bet you it's all the same components. So let's take a look. Got our peelable seal. Piece of cake. This one is Sapaco. And it's exactly what the 20... Menu 21 lemon pepper tuna components. But we got a chicken breast and garlic and herb. Hot and spicy crackers. And a carrot pound cake. Got my favorite chocolate dairy shake. We also got a pack of peanuts. And we got our tortillas and our fat free mayo. Got our spoon, our accessory kit. Our accessory kit has beverage based lemonade. Moist towelette, some kind of seasoning, toilet paper, salt, wet nap. Pretty standard. No FRH. Chocolate dairy shake, that's my favorite dairy shake powder. I wish they brought this stuff back. The protein shake's good, but this stuff, it's more like a chocolate ice cream. And it goes into six ounces, whatever water temperature you like. That's a ton of powder. And we'll give that a shake. And just so you know, there's 12 grams of protein in a dairy shake and I think like 13 or 15 maybe in the protein drink. And our lemonade goes, lemonade? Lemonade goes into up to 20 ounces of whatever temperature water you like. And I have cold water in the fridge. Well, win some, you lose some. Slightest bit chunky, which I've never seen in a uh, one of those sugar-free drinks. Shake that up. Hot and spicy. Baked snack cra crackers. That's Cheez-Its, right? Whew. They done gone bad. Yeah, I thought maybe it was just the heat, but look at them, they actually held up. They're not completely crushed. But those, yeah. Um, some of this stuff doesn't last forever. I've had this for like five years, maybe like six, seven years. Um, I should have reviewed it or eaten it right away because now it's 10 years old and uh, although, the components in a lot of the MCWs are still okay, but yeah, not not eating that. Maybe our peanuts will be all right. I had peanuts earlier today. I had a Lithuanian civilian ration for lunch. It came with peanuts, nice hiss. Those are all kind of spotted and I forgot to put my phone on uh, airplane mode. My sister's FaceTiming me, she can wait. So these don't smell bad, we're just gonna try one. So you see how they're all kind of off color? They taste fine though. Let's go ahead and wash that down with our chocolate dairy shake. the good 
good stuff. You have to be careful with the dairy shakes from like around 2008, 2009. They had uh, E. coli in them or some crap. If you have older rations, just Google it and it'll pop up the exact dates that you don't want to touch, but we're good with this one, probably. So garlic and herb seasoned chicken breast. Ingredients, boneless, skinless chicken breast fillets with rib, rib meat. Water, some other stuff. Oh, I hope this doesn't kill me. Something about um, something about old chicken just it smells good. That onto our tray. Oh, fuck's sakes. I am so glad we got that on freaking camera. Oh, we have chicken juice all over our steering wheel, all over our leg, lap, clipboard, all over my hand. <sighs> Who'd have thought? We'll be right back. Okay, we're gonna do this again. Oh, everything's sticky. Like, I don't have running water or anything, so like it's just, it's there now. I now have chicken juice in my truck forever. Nice and gently. Beautiful, and that smells actually as good as it looks. Got a little more spray. Um, actually it smells. For the Canadians, you know those Mark Angelo chicken kebabs you buy in the packs for the barbecue? That's what this smells like exactly. Just like a seasoned fake ass chicken breast. And it's kind of coming apart like a piece of fish. That's uh, kind of weird. It. Like it looks like chicken, it smells like chicken, it can probably kill you like chicken. We are going to try it because it does seem perfectly fine. It actually smells good. This would be really good menu fresh. Aside from being the driest piece of chicken, like drier than even a Canadian IMP, any kind of chicken, um, it tastes good. Let's get out our tortillas. They smell a little bit funky. Maybe I shouldn't eat that chicken. Yeah. Um, almost like dog food, like dry dog food. Has a bit of a dusty smell. Yeah, not eating that. Which means we don't have to eat that. And that's all right with me. Gonna wash that down with our lemonade before we get into our dessert. For dessert, we have our carrot pound cake. It's starting to sweat, it's hot, Arkansas is hot. Oh, it's year round. And that's when pound cakes were actually cakes. None of this round muffin top looking bullshit. Little brick of it. Yeah, and that smells good. Finally. The peanuts are pretty good too. A 
Looks like that, little chunks of carrot. Smells of like cinnamon. That's good. So I bought this like yesterday because I like icing on my cake and you can't go wrong with Dunkaroos. It's got now with more rainbow sprinkles, which I had called chips. Those aren't sprinkles. Anyway, that's gonna go on a carrot cake. Beautiful stuff. And you can bitch all you want that they don't have this in the army. They got Walmarts in every town and army bases are in towns. They have access to Dunkaroos icing. So this is probably done all the time. Good healthy amount onto our carrot cake. And that can go on any cake. Maybe not the lemon pea cake. That's awesome. In fact, I just gave Mrs. Trucker a tutorial <clears throat> on how to make my birthday cake for next week when I'm home. And uh, it contains two cans of this, so yeah. So this is our 2013 Menu 21 Chicken Breast Filet Garlic Herb and Seasonings. Better than tuna. I would have this anytime ahead of the friggin' tuna ration. like. It should be changed permanently, in my mind. Everything's good. The uh, dairy shakes, they still have them in the first strike rations, but you only get like vanilla and banana strawberry. We need to all pray to the MRE gods to bring back chocolate and the strawberry dairy shakes and put them back in the rations because they're freaking killer. Carrot cake's awesome. Peanuts were actually still fresh. It was a great ration all around. I, I don't know if I, ever, I would ever eat the mayonnaise. It's just weird. But, uh, yeah, that's about it. So, pretty cool to check out because you don't see these every day. And that's why I jumped on it. I probably paid like 25 bucks for it or something stupid the way I do. Um, but yeah, wish I would have tried it a few years ago rather than waited till it was, you know, darn near too late. But I don't feel sick yet. I might wake up tomorrow if I don't. I'd blame this. Thanks for coming, everybody. See you next time.